Oh, look at that. Has he learned to love children? Probably not. Three, two, one. <laughs> Welcome, friends, to the Great Detective Legacy Challenge. This is episode 14. Now, Yuki wanted to come in and say hello as I did my intro, and now she is gone. It has been a couple weeks since I ended up doing my last episode for the Great Detective Legacy Challenge, and I just wanted to apologize for the huge gap in time frame. I had to mentally prepare for the fact that Babsby ended up pregnant again. And I also, she has the fertility trait, so she could have had one, two, or three children. And I was not ready to either have child eight, nine, or ten. I had to mentally prepare for all this. So, without further ado, let's go ahead and jump into this video. I want to do, I want to do, I also want to say before we actually jump into it, one just small thing. This is actually the first time I'm doing a live reaction or a live recording as I play the game. So sorry if it's just a little bit flat. I'm going to be working on it, so my energy is going to be a little bit higher in the future videos. So just kind of bear with me through this. I'm glad you're here. Let's jump in. And with a quick wardrobe change, <laughs> it's been a couple days. I ended up taking a small little break, mentally preparing myself for the fact that we are going to be having birthdays today. Plural, we got two. It is going to be Heath's birthday and Akam's birthday. Yay! And it's lottery day, so maybe we'll luck out and we'll win the lottery. Fingers crossed. All right, so what do we got going on? Let's make sure everybody is accounted for. And no one has spontaneously spawned to somebody's driveway since I did close the game. You're just creepily watching over my children there, Nanny. I know, you don't know what to do. The kids are asleep. And for a first... Both of the infants are actually in their bassinets. Well, not bassinets. In their crib sleeping. That's a first. Okay. There's Mayor Whiskers. And Maya is out and about doing her thing. Okay. So you woke up and you're happy. And instantly the nanny's like, I have something to do. So what can we do with you today? While well, everybody else is asleep. We definitely need to work on tummy time. Can I work on any of my stuff by clicking on you? Get fed by Devin. Okay. Oh, and I need to check. Is my butler in bed? He is. All right. I don't have to worry about trying to find him again. He disappears on me a lot. Oh. <laughs> Mayor Whiskers. Let's see. Sleep next to Mayor Whiskers. Babble it. Oh, I want to babble. I want to talk to Mayor Whiskers. He's my bud. And I want to. I want to sleep next to him. What's that do while he's licking himself? So how is Lydia's stuff going? Her milestone. She's not doing too bad for the milestones. No, and not. Not too bad. Mayor Whiskers is just sitting there like, what is this small thing? <laughs> I love Mayor Whiskers. Oh, what's wrong? What's wrong, Stephanie? Oh. What's the matter, honey bunny? Why are we angry? Oh, you're a groggy monster. Okay. Well, if your sister's not awake, let's not wake her up. Let's actually, let's go yell at the nanny. That's what we'll do instead. No, no, don't cry. No, oh, you woke up your sister. Oh. Well, now that you're awake, what do you need? Did you do your homework? Do extra credit. Mm, not necessary. What do you still need to do? You need to become friends with three other children. Are there any children out and about in the world at five in the morning? The random cat, Grover, 
An elder? Ugh. You know, I picked this area because it had the high, the largest lot, and now I just see all these cats, and I'm like, you know, baby. No, there's not really. How did you become acquaintance? Wait, acquaintances how? Who's Wolfie? Who is that? It's adult, female, loyal, stubborn, and playful. Is it somebody's dog, though? Pets often feel strongly about someone, but this pet doesn't seem to feel much of anything. Oh, it feels so bad. They're loyal, stubborn, and playful. Can, But whose dog is it? And how did you become friends with it? What's wrong? Oh, you got the tummy gurgles. That's okay. What do you want to do? Analyze a book. You know what? Why don't we go over here to the bookcase and clean up the books. And go do that. And we'll find a book to read. It's lottery day. I know. Everybody is waking up. Oh, Babsby. Girl, you be big. Look at you. You can put a plate on that tummy. But we need to plan a birthday party. Now, everybody has taken the day off work. So we don't need to worry about that. Babsby is... Working on getting more promotions. You still want to get a child earn an A in high school? Well, oh, Heath is about to give you that. You're a happy little clam. Okay. So we are going to try to do... Can I do a double birthday party? Now, if I wanted to do a birthday party... And you are... Where are you at? You are going to give birth any minute now. Oh, look at that. Has he learned to love children? Probably not. You are playing with clay for some reason, but I need you. We're still working on trying to get you a promotion. So let's make an arrangement. Uh, let's work on our skills a bit. Eh, it's a bit pricey, but that's okay. Then after that... Have I lost my money tree again? Ugh. Fertilize. You know what? Fertilize with a potato. What do you want to do? You know what I would like you to do? I would like you to bake. I want you to serve breakfast. Let's make a nice breakfast. Let's make pancakes. Yeah. She is feeling great today. Okay, what are we up to, little man? You're aging up today. You got everything perfect. Water shutoff day is now in effect in accordance with the water conservative for the next 12 hours. Till 9 o'clock tonight? Okay, maybe we'll have a birthday party. Hopefully nobody needs to shower. Hmm. What would you like to do, little man? You're pretty much set. You're ready for a birthday. You're napping. Babsby's making some pancakes. My butler is contemplating life's existence, which is beautiful. He's wondering why he even has this job. I don't think I actually pay him. I don't actually think I pay him. I think he just lives here. Oh. Sick with worry. It's test day and Aubrey is so nervous she totally blanks. 
even copying her neighbor won't work because her neighbor is a D student. What to do? Fa feign illness or just take a deep breath. Just take a deep breath. It's fine. Ribo. Aubrey tries to quell her anxiety by taking deep, big deep breaths. And what do you know? It works. Sure, her classmates shoot her some funny looks. But when you're an A student, you have to keep every t test seriously. Well, you got to take every test seriously if I read that right. What is up with everybody in this thing of clay? Okay, I need you now to cook a sugar-free coconut. Oh, coconut cake sounds so good. Oh, good. Your royalties where your book came in. Where are you? Where are you? Okay, we're talking to the bees. Now, you are aging up. You are going to be a teenager now. So, what I want to do is kind of... Boy, what do I want Heath to end up being? Since he's the oldest, I feel like he deserves... Let's go ahead and go into build mode. I feel like Heath deserves to go through like an angsty teen phase. You know, like, grr, growl, I'm mad at the world. You know, like the angsty teen phase we all kind of went through. So, let's embrace this Let's embrace this skull rug and this red, white, and black stripes. I don't think that looks too bad. It looks like a teenage boy's room, or at least what I would envision a teenage boy's room looking like. So that's that. We got this kind of set up a bit, but Occam. Occam is gonna need his own little room. Him and his sister are gonna have to be separated. So I guess that might mean that he gets banished to this to the third floor where the butler lives. I mean there are worse things. Okay, so what color theme did I kind of give you, little one? You're kind of more of like a little green. That is perfect. So let's kind of, let's find a light for the room for, oops, let's find a light for the room first. 
Maybe you'll be my little nature baby. You just love nature. Oops. Like, nature is your jam. Let's see what we have in the swash of green. How hard is that to look at? Ooh, that's different. I don't hate it. I don't know if I love it, though. Uh, ooh. I don't know why I love that one so much, but let's lean into this color. Actually, let's take that backpack and move it. There we go. Okay. So both boys have their rooms set up. I also need to go back outside. Boop, boop. And I have three children's bikes. I'm going to need an adult bike. Because I don't know if he can ride that. Oh. Let's do... Uh... <laughs> Let's do tummy time. Yeah! Tummy time! Oh, you're awake. What are you up to? You're heading to the bathroom? Oh, you're sad? That's okay. You got this. How are you doing with your... You gotta work on your thinking, but... I don't think you age up and... Ah, I'm running out of time to get you on your thinking skill. Oh my goodness, so many birthdays! <laughs> ah. So, if this... Where it... Oh, oh okay. Okay. Hmm. Oh, it's in here. Add an event. Let's see. Birthday party. Okay. Oh, I don't have to have it at home. The birthday sim. And boop. Click on the guess. Wait, no, you're the birthday. No, you have to stay with the kids. You guys are not coming. Little one can come. I don't know who any of these people are, but they're all adults. We don't have any kid friends. Oh, Heath, I'm so sorry. I have failed you. I don't know who this is. You're coming. You're the butler. You gotta stay home. Let's invite a firefighter. <laughs> so we are gonna have it at... Sprucewood Square Celebration Center. Let's go here. So that cost me 850. I'm let's start. Birthday party hype. 
So I don't, I have never been to this community a lot, so this should be kind of interesting to see how this turns out. All right, so I don't know what I'm doing here. Let's just, no, no, I don't want to end the holiday. I just, hmm. have Sims playing games at the same time. All right, where am I? Oh, yeah. Less. Let's build a puzzle together. What was what was that notification? Oh, okay, that's not it. And I want you to sit and sit and I want you to talk to I want you to uh, we'll feed you talk to as well where did you find food oh there little one grab a serving of that heck yeah there's gonna be free food here so I'm pretty sure I hired uh, a mixologist but one is upstairs There's a ghost here. You're trying. All right. Good for you. Good for you. Okay. So clearly I didn't do this right. Still. That's fine. I'm someday I'm going to figure out how to do these events, but. Oh, there's the caterer. Hey. Oh, there's the mixologist. Okay. All right, Heath, I am going to need you to come. Uh, blow out camp, make a wish. I know you're in labor. You're gonna be fine. Hold them in, it in. One, we don't want one, but she can have triplets, so. I know, everybody's stinky because the water got shut off. Wait, where are you going, Babsby? That's fine, Heath. I'm here for you, baby boy. Yay! Yay! Happy birthday! Welcome to the teenage phase. Heath has earned a bonus trait. See all of his bonus traits in the Simology panel. Teenage um dum dum dum. Romantic travels, sweaty gym shorts, and hormonal upheavals await. Best buckle those boots. The ride starts here. <laughs> okay. So there are traits that are just for teens, so we're just going to go ahead and do that. And let's say that he is going to be... A, I said he's going through his angsty phase, so he's going to be a drama llama. Which means he's... Uh, okay, cool. Oh, and I get to pick another one. Uh, let's do random. Uh, materialistic. Oh, you're going to make me go poor. Okay, well, here we go. Oh, growl. Look at you. Uh, okay, we'll examine everybody in a second. I'm not sure what's all over your face, though. We're going to have to look at that. Uh, but, Akira, I need you to put birthday candles on the cake again. Quick, before anybody eats anything. Perfect. Now, Akam, it's your birthday, baby boy. Ask help for blowing out the candles. Boop. From, uh, I don't know what mom's doing. We'll do dad. Uh -huh. 
Oh. <laughs> Yay! <laughs> and are you gonna age up? Oh, oh, you gotta adjust yourself and Whee! Okay, childhood, boundless creative. Rule breaking and temper tantrums await. Let the games begin. Okay, so I already have that one. Oh, there's a lot in here. Okay. Let's do Well, I want you to be kind of a tree person, so with friends. Let's do that one. And good. Okay. <laughs> nice. Okay. Now Babsby. <laughs> Unfortunately, okay, we are going to end this. Yes, we're going to end it early. I need everybody to go home <laughs> it's just gonna leave babsby we'll get everybody home then we'll go to the hospital we will have our baby it will be the last baby because i have too many <laughs> ah okay let's get babsby to wake back up we're gonna hire back our No, wait, wait, no, 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 no. Where are you going? All right, well, <laughs> we're not going to make it to the hospital. Okay. All righty, here we go. She's probably going to pee herself. Congratulations, it's, it's a boy. Elliot, I'm okay with that. Just one? We only had one kid! Huh. Okay, okay, okay. Uh, we'll take care of everything. Let's hire a service. Let's get our butler back. I know! Everybody's still in the house, right? Yeah, okay. Okay, now Babsby... I need you to take a shower and I need you to go to bed. You've had a rough day, but you only had one baby. That's beautiful. All right, so let's go find Heath. Heath, what are we doing, young man? Let's, let's see what you look like, young man, in all of your glory. Ladaba, Ribiyoyum. Boy, I'm... You got randomized a little oddly. <laughs> okay. So first things first. No makeup, my sweet. At least not that flam... Flamboyant. I don't know. Lizzie's a teenager. Your face is so smooshed. <laughs> I don't know why that is. Alright, let's give you some ear piercings. Or maybe we could be like, I wanted my septum pierced, which sounds really painful. I've been informed it's not as bad as it seems, but...
Not too shabby, kiddo. Not too shabby. Awkward teen. Gotta love it. How come little birthday boy, though? Let's take a gander at you. Let's see how you look. Oh, you ended up with freckles. That's really cute. Oh, I'm digging. I'm digging the outfit. Look at you. You know what? I don't feel like I want to change anything. I think... I think your things turned out super cute. Although, I will kind of modify this one. Give you some socks. Oh, mismatched socks. Definitely. And then you don't really need your jacket on if you're going to be running around the house. Yeah, that works. Little cutie patootie. He turned out cute. Alright. So, I think this is where I am going to leave it for this episode. We have aged up two of our children. Heath is now a teenager waiting to go into that angsty phase. And Akim is now a child. So this should be fun. And we only had one kid. And Elliot is going to be the last. Hopefully. <laughs> for having children in this legacy challenge. So as long as Babsby does not get pregnant again, Elliot is going to be continuing on the Great Detective legacy challenge. So hopefully it works out that way, but I'm gonna go ahead and get everybody in bed sleeping peacefully. And I look forward to seeing everybody in the next episode of the Great Detective legacy challenge where we end up seeing what weird things end up happening. Thank you for watching, and I will see you next time. Bye for now. Ooh. Sorry, Ona. <laughs> sorry, kiddo. I didn't mean to nudge you a little bit. I'm sorry. <laughs> Are you okay? Didn't mean to wake you up. I'm sorry.